Hello, I'm Jason Radebaugh, a technical marketing engineer here at Infoblox. Today I'm going to talk to you about Infoblox v Discovery for Google Cloud Platform. Infoblox v Discovery is an easy to deploy solution that provides visibility and automation for resources across your private and public clouds. By running v Discovery from an on premise grid member or a member running on Google Cloud Platform, you can gain enhanced visibility of your cloud networks and virtual machine instances, and automate the creation of DNS records for your virtual machines. Let's take a look in our Infoblox grid manager. This grid currently has no IPAM data and a single authoritative DNS zone with only SOA and name server records. First, we will create a service account in our GCP project to use for Infoblox v Discovery. We need to assign this account the viewer role at the project level to allow discovery of all resources in this project. Next, we will create and download a JSON key to use for authentication from our Infoblox grid. Back in the Grid Manager, we navigate to the IPAM tab, select vDiscovery, and open the Discovery Manager. Next, we will create a new vDiscovery job. We select a grid member to run the job. This member can be on-premise or running as a GCP instance. For server type, we'll select GCP. Then, we'll upload the JSON key file we created earlier. To automate creation of DNS records for VM instances, we will enter a simple macro that concatenates the VM name with our existing DNS zone. You can find additional macros available for this by clicking on the help icon. While NIOS prepares to run the vDiscovery job, we'll take a look at the resources in the GCP project which will be discovered. This GCP project contains four VM instances, some with multiple IP addresses. It also contains two VPCs with three subnets. Back in the Grid Manager, we will now run the vDiscovery job. vDiscovery can be scheduled to find new or modified resources as often as every hour. Once the job is complete, we can return to the IPAM tab and find information on our VPC subnets as well as any public networks the VMs are connected to. Digging deeper into the networks, we can see IP address usage, and information on the VMs using individual IP addresses. On the DNS tab, we can see host records which were automatically created for each of the VM instances. The Cloud Network Automation License adds greater visibility into our resources with the Cloud tab in Grid Manager. Here we can see information on the projects or tenants we are discovering. The Network tab gives us another consolidated view of our cloud networks. Additional data specific to our various resources is stored as extensible attributes in the grid. The VMs tab shows us more information on our VM instances, including the availability zones and projects they are in. Infoblox v Discovery brings your hybrid cloud resources into a single view for automation of DNS and IPAM services. Thank you for watching. Have a great day.